Folks, good morning. Welcome to uh, Talamore. We're on the new course at Talamore. Talamore is about an uh, eight minute drive from Pinehurst Resorts. <sighs> Their website says, most choices, best value. So this is gonna be a place where you can play for, uh, you know, perhaps not as much coin as some of the other joints in the area. Look, you're three miles from Pinehurst. So uh, if you like the sand hills, if you like Pinehurst, it's the same stuff. We're here in the sand hills of North Carolina. It is gorgeous. We're in Southern Pines. And we've got, um, over here, these guys are getting a little scared, but, I mean, we got fucking llamas over there, all right? This is the home of the llama caddy. Those fucking guys will caddy for you. That's kind of the situation here at Talamore. Um, they got three, no, two courses. They got Mid-South, which I've done before. is awesome, and I've never been to Talamore, amazingly. Been by here a bunch of times, haven't played it, so I figured I'd swing in. It's 30 degrees, um, so it's a little dicey. This is just gonna be a fairway finder, try to get this thing into onto the grass between the trees. I love the 14th hole, 380. Um, kind of winds through these uh, pine trees here in North Carolina, which I like. It just kind of whoop, 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 a little bunkering. Um, don't know what the green looks like. We're about to find out. I do know what my shoes look like. These are G4s, all right? This is the best shoe in the world. Uh, the Gallivanter, I'm wearing the uh, MG4s, which is probably the most comfortable shoe ever created. But look, G4 shoes are changing the game. The Gallivanter is so awesome, classiest shoe in golf. Class, 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 they say, and unbelievably comfortable. So if you like to be uh, and look classy, be classy, be comfortable, and also look cool, Gallivanter is your answer. They got all kinds of spring options now. You're checking out the site. Uh, it's so good that other companies, I believe, are just copying the Gallivanter. I think that's what's happening, which I don't blame them. It's the best shoe ever. Um, and then the MG4, which I'm wearing right now, they got all kinds of cool styles. This is the Ghost Limited Edition. You can't get this. Um, but man, they got the snow. Um, they got the... Uh, um, I saw like Pittsburgh Steeler color ones, I think Frankie got. Um, so this is the MG4 is the most comfortable shoe ever created. Gallivanter, probably the best all around shoe. Driver, we're gonna try to just hit, uh, we're gonna try to be a shot shaper here and hit a sling and draw. Let's see what happens. G4.com, 10% off first order. So <clears throat> you are welcome, happy spring. I got kind of springish colors going on here, I guess, maybe. G4 hat too, this thing's sick. All right, tee shot. Wow. Fucking llamas, dude. Oh, yeah. A little bit left. A little bit left. Oh, yeah. Ball's not going anywhere. It is. I will confirm that. I'm going to show you the temperature right now. I mean, it is. <laughs> 31 degrees right now. Oh, 34, it went up to 34. See, that ball didn't travel. Oh, 35 now, it's getting hot. Here we go. Okay, good tee shot, it's a miracle in this weather. Uh, we got 122 uh, flag, we got a little back right pin. It looks like long is horrific. Uh, a little bit of room left of the pin, but I think, again, if, since the back pin, if you go pin high, catches that slope long, and it could be, um, see you later. A little bit dormant grass. It's been about 20 degrees the last few nights here at Piner. It's supposed to get nice this week, 60, 70, 80 degrees, but a um, little bit dormant grass. It's been tough weather out here. It's supposed to get nice again, like I said, but um, I'll have to come back out here in the summertime when this place is popping, when it's flourishing, and give Talmore maybe a little bit more, but still gorgeous, as you can see. Beautiful kind of surrounds, surrounds. It's always a good term in golf. Um, four over through six, so this is a big hole. I'd love to make a birdie. Four over through six thus far this year. Things are going well, par par. Sloppy bogey, but then man, ever since that bladed bunker shot at Verado, things have kind of come off the hinges. So we got a smooth pitching wedge. I don't think the ball's going anywhere because it's fucking cold, 35 degrees right now. <clears throat> so we're gonna hit a uh, pitching wedge right at the pin, that's the plan. Landed a little bit short. I got about 30, 40 feet, it looks like. Not the worst shot. Not the best shot. Didn't get a great kick. We uh, got a birdie look. All right, 30 footer. I think uh, uphill the whole way. Pretty makeable. I know it's a 30 footer. I know the tour average is very low. I know Riggs average is very low. 30 footer though on this, I'm kind of uphill and then a little right to left at the end. Kind of like this. 
beautiful little setting as you can I didn't even know this hole has a nice view of the clubhouse uh, sun peeking through the trees quite delightful I would say <laughs> kind of ready to go crazy there, but now I got about a three foot uh, tickler. Got to make these folks, just have to make them. Little left to rider. Not the easiest putt in the world, but. Close enough, this just has to go in. It's going to be, I can tell these things got some movement because this puppy is going to slide. You just got to trust it, it's outside the hole. Shoes are popping as they should be. Go check out the Galavanders. Go check out the MG4s, the MG4. Uh, there's all kinds of good stuff. So um, G4.com, get yourself 10% off. Talamore, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go 70. A um, couple under par, it's a great score. You post four rounds in the 70s, you're probably finishing top 10, maybe even winning a golf tournament, depending on your level of play. Um, had to have a par there, big time for me. G4.com, get yourself 10% off. See you later.